Hello everyone, it's Agatha, and today I'm going to try to make dango, um, which are like, they're basically rice cakes and they're usually put with uh, bean paste or a sort of sweet soy sauce kind of thing. So yeah, I thought I'd make the doughs, the dough, um, <laughs> and yeah, so I have a plain bowl. Um, I'm making sort of a different kind of healthier version. Normally you don't use this, but here's silken tofu. And this is sweet rice flour. Wow, I didn't know my camera reversed things. Yeah, mochiko is... Yeah, if you look up sweet rice flour or glutinous rice flour, you can find that. I'm not sure of the exact measurements to use because the ones I look up are always in grams. And as an American, that's not very helpful. So <laughs> I'm going to just sort of add and see how much seems like enough. so good. I know it's weird to say like flour that smells good but it to me it does. I have like a I have a taste for it. Oof. It looks like yogurt. And basically you mix this stuff together until it forms a sticky dough. I might have to use my hands. Yeah, I will. Try putting it all in. You can always add more flour.
today I'm going to be making a bunch of things. I have... We'll start slow because we're early. Willie GV the bandage is because I got some kind of weird irritation on my face and then I put a bandage on it and it kind of made it worse so now we're just going with it. This is miso soup. Hi, yes, Madison. My day has been pretty good. Sorry I'm eating the soup right now. It's just that I don't like to eat it when it gets cold. Hi Frog with the blog. Hi Lemon Drop. Sorry your name's far away. <laughs> Hi Worm. You're here you've been here every time. But anyway, so today we have, let me just turn this little thing on. I thought this stove was broken, but it is actually not. Woohoo, sound is fixed. Hi, Cosmic Spud. Oh, uh, yeah, my face. I just got an irritation, like, kind of sore on my face, and then I was like, oh, what am I going to do? And then I put a band aid on it, but then the band aid stickiness made it worse, so now we're just. We're just in business with that. Yes, Madison said, this is a random question, but I was wondering if you have advice on how to become a better singer. What methods of practice were most useful to you? Uh, that's hard because I'm not a very technically good singer at all. Hi, Aggie Zaggy. Um, well, who else here? But I'd say basically the thing is to practice your breathing. Make sure you're engaging your diaphragm. Um, what else? Um, Yep, we're making yaki onigiri. Here I have the onigiri rice balls. Um, yeah, so when you're singing, make sure you're engaging your diaphragm. Um, that's the most important thing. Um, make sure you don't make any... If a sound hurts to make, don't make it. Like, that's important. Um record yourself and listen back so you can know what you're really sounding like this is the rice ball as it is now this is it's white rice mixed with sesame seeds and soy sauce and in the middle cheese Ooh, thank you for following sorry your name's too far away i can't see it hi lisping legends hi woolly shocks Where's Elle? Elle, say hi to me. I didn't see you. Ooh. Hi, missionary. Oh, yay, Elle, there you are. It's very sizzly. Can you hear me? Oh, there are people following, but your names are too far away. Sorry, I can't see you.
Got any ASMR videos planned for the future? <laughs> yeah, um, I think so because, um, I'm almost, I'm getting closer to being able to afford the binaural microphone so that you can hear in both ears at the same time different sounds. Bruno Nada. Hi Mike. Hi Yolo. Everybody, my face is fine. I just basically have a sore on my face and I'm too embarrassed to show it. Bruno, you're not too late. I've only been on a couple minutes. Supreme gentlemen, these are rice balls filled with cheese. I'm frying them. <laughs> it's rice balls, everyone. I'm frying them up. And in the middle, they have cheese. It's soy sauce, sesame seed, and inside cheese. Hi, Positive Polly. Samuel, I have had a mustache since eight years old. Me too. I shave it. That's right, Elle. It broke the, this pan, we were going to use it to make lot because at Elle's house, but it just broke, just for that occasion. Yeah, mods, mods. Listen legend, oh yeah, it's good. Fried onigiri. I stole this recipe from Kinoshita Yuka. You guys know her? Uh, the Japanese woman who like eats gigantic amounts. Except she deep fried them. That's like too much for me. Uh, Mike and I, yeah, the mustache does grow back stronger, but I just keep shaving it off. Yeah, it's kind of an urban myth that hair grows back stronger when you cut it. What's true is that the ends are thick because you, they've been cut blunt. So they look, it looks thicker. Hi, a Canadian hobo. Kana, let's not talk that way about people. No, Kinoshita Yuka has a stomach condition and she has like some kind of malabsorption condition so she can eat huge amounts. Yeah, waxing, not worth it. Oh, yeah. Hi, King Pugster. It's okay, Kana. Good to you guys. For later, later I have dango. These are, they're just like rice balls with nothing inside. Mm, different kind of rice ball to this. Rice cake, more like. Um, and I'll eat that with bean paste. Everyone's just talking about their facial hair now. Um, Moon, uh, it's so hard to see people's usernames. 
some lemon drops. Yeah, I do actually need glasses, <laughs> but I don't wear them usually. I'm not sure exactly where they are now. No eggs today. Wait, as a matter of fact, I do have eggs for today. Thank you for reminding me. Very perceptive. I'll bring them out after I cook this. Yeah, Elle, I wish you were here because I'm not going to be able to eat both of these with all the stuff I have. Yolo says, how can rice be disappointing? Rice is very rarely disappointing. I'd say the only time rice is disappointing is if you cook it wrong. Be right back guys, watch this. Anything happened while I was gone? See what I have here is egg mixture for tamagoya tamagoyaki. Oh. this egg is for stuff guys guys <laughs> egg toven <laughs> hmm, I wonder what you said all that's got censored by my blacklist everyone type your username but with eggs in it this egg thing yeah it is pretty forced Destiny DS77, hi, you're here again. Oh, Egg Toven, Cosmic Egg, Eggy Lace, Number Egg Yelpin, <laughs> The Egg Assassin. What if your username already has eggs, then you lose, or do you win? Depends on how you look at it. Will Egg V, don't like it. Yeah, it, it doesn't have a very good ring to it. King Eggster. Utopian Hamlets, uh, hi. <laughs> all the eggs, all the eggs. How many of you are here now? I feel like you're really talkative today. Shorts, I guess. Hi. Hi, everybody. Hi, Lainey Chan. Hi, Young Kek. Uh, hi. Uh, Destiny, I'm cooking fried rice balls filled with cheese. Egg isn't blacklisted. <laughs> hi, Utopian Hamlets. Hi, Gert the Great, thanks for coming. I did not blacklist egg everybody. Yes, 
filled with cheese. Yeah, I am awfully close to the skillet. I burned my hand the other day on something. I just I need to like back off when I'm cooking things, but um trying to read. It is a nice plate. We've had this in the family for about a decade. These same plates. Moon King says the rice balls look better than my future. Mm, that's not necessarily horrible, but I hope your future goes well. Yes, I'm gonna show the melty cheese inside. Yes, Madison. No, I don't play Animal Crossing. I'm paranoid that I won't cook them enough for the cheese to get melty. So I'm probably overdoing it a bit. Um, it's cheddar cheese. Are you gonna eat all the food? Probably not, no. Did you make the rice balls yourself? Yep. And so good. Uh, I don't think I should accept free lodging. <laughs> I know there's a thing on my face, everybody. It's to relax. <laughs> and so cool. Okay, I'll make you pay. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll, I'm gonna upload the recipe to YouTube later tonight, probably, or tomorrow morning. I have videotaped all that. So let's cut and see what's inside. Oh wow, oh look at that. Do you see the cheese guys? Send a pic of the rice balls to Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Perhaps I should. Let's take a picture and send it to Gordon Ramsay. Oh my god. It's good. You have to make the eggs now. How much soy sauce did you put? Not that much. Yeah, the camera is Canon T5i. How many eggs is that? It's three. I'm making tamagoyaki.
Okay, let's put this egg on the plate. It's not tea, it's just ice water. <laughs> I guess my eye shattered eye iPad is faking too. <laughs> Yeah, I got this from the Korean market. <laughs> I won't play in the skillet with my sleeves. Is the camera angle a little too high, do you guys think? Thank you, YOLO. Okay, cool. I wish I could live stream with my better camera, but DSLR doesn't really, there's some complicated way to do it. <laughs> Should've brought a knife. Nice chopsticks, are they wood? Yep, they're wood. I'm glad you were able to come today, Al. Oh, the egg actually tastes really good. Okay, so let's do a rundown. I have rice balls filled with cheese. I have egg. I have miso soup. I have dango. And I have bean paste to go with it. Rainy face, yeah, we want. Helen and I want to do a stream together soon. Everyone's always asking for El. I get anons and stuff on Tumblr all the time like, bring El, bring El. Eggs are seasoned with soy sauce, meeting, um, what else, um, uh, broth that, broth of she mushrooms and, um, kelp, um, I'm gonna post a recipe on my YouTube tomorrow, so, look up three milk tea YouTube, or look, no, I'm not gonna eat this whole can. See, Elle says she's coming, guys. Be patient. Not today, in the future. Pam shins. <laughs> Aww. I'm not chugging the bean paste. <laughs> Will Beethoven bring her sass too? She never leaves the house without it.
it's still February 21st here. My birthday's tomorrow. Thank you, everyone. I don't really have plans for tomorrow. Probably later this week. Happy birthday from Ireland. Thank you. Wow, Ireland. What time is it in Ireland? If you were over 18, what did you do for your 18th birthday? Happy birthday from Tel Aviv. Thank you. Wow, a lot of different places. From Spain. Wow. Moon Creams says, for 18, I had a little party at my house with friends. That sounds ideal. I'm not much of a party goer or a party haver. <laughs> Slept in, ate pizza. Sounds like people had pretty low-key birthdays. Stayed inside and played Doom and got sad. Well, that's sorry, Frog with the blog. Rainy Face says, I just had a small dinner with a couple of friends. Yeah, that sounds nice. These are dango, which are rice cakes. Um, yeah, rice cakes, and I'm putting bean paste on them. It's sweet. The rice cakes aren't sweet, but the bean paste is. Thirty a.m. here in the UK, so it is your birthday here. Well, I actually wasn't born until 10 p.m. on the 22nd, so perhaps it depends on how you look at it. Are you getting glasses? I have glasses somewhere. My left eye is my bad eye. I can't read the things with just my left. Time zones are so we weird, lol. Yeah, it is weird. What did they... It's strange. Before they... Before, like, Western cultures knew that the Earth was round, how did they account for time zones? Were they just... Did they just lose so much time in general that they weren't aware of it when they traveled?
every town had their own time, basically. People didn't travel that much. That's wild. <clears throat> Monocles, is that like... Oh my god, that's so cool. Is that like what those old time you guys have in illustrations? That would be so cool. Kim's birthday is in August. I'm not, I don't remember, I don't really know what day I'd have to check, like her files or something. But Pam is seven. Show us what your glasses look like sometime. If I can find them, I'll bring them out. Oh, <laughs> Evie's five months already. Time flies. I miss Evie. I haven't seen her in like two weeks. I also miss Elle, but that's... Scoobity doobity doo says my birthday is the day after New Year, so I always know what age I was in a year. Ann Sulker says, please keep this set up. No usernames and donations flying all over the stream. Um, I do have notifications turned on, but not a lot happens, so <laughs> I don't get notified. <laughs> time zones were invented alongside the train, because you needed to know what time the train would arrive. Wow. Interesting. The Lonely Assassin Pictures was born on New Year's Day. Wow. That's convenient. Today I was at the bank and I needed to write the date on a piece of paper. And I couldn't remember what day it was and then I looked at the they had some like T V screen or something playing the news weather. And it, and it said the date, and I was like, oh, my birthday's tomorrow. Why would I forget what date it is? <laughs> this is awkward to eat. Solker says, just my opinion. Notifications are okay, but not marquee and stuff. Haha. Ha. I'm not even sure what that is, so I think you're in luck. You cannot. S no one is stealing Adina Menzel from me. I know that she is like engaged or whatever and has a kid and all but I'm number one fan yes I hunted the rice myself I'm getting a bit full so I think in a bit I'll put the food away
singing next? Sure. Sure, we can do that. Okay, this stuff is filling. People say I eat a lot, but like... It's nothing compared to like the real original Korean mukbang where they're eating like... Like wow, just wow. But all the food came out really good. 